Hey, this is Kevin from Breakdance, and in this video, we're going to go over the advanced custom fields integration available in Breakdance. To get started, you'll want to have advanced custom fields installed and several fields already created. Next, we'll open up Breakdance and we'll add a new field. In this case, I'm going to add a text element, and then I'm going to click the dynamic data button in the properties pane on the left side of the screen. This will open the dynamic data pop-up with our available fields. We'll now see that there is an area for ACF fields. These are organized by the different post types. So we have the destination post type fields, and we also have the itinerary post type fields. Breakdance also separates any repeater fields from the rest of your fields into their own categories. We can then select a field and the data will automatically update in Breakdance. The element that you're working on will determine what ACF fields are available. So if we add an image to the page and then click the dynamic data button, we'll see different ACF fields than we saw with the text element. You can then select that field and it will update in Breakdance. This setup is also true for other elements such as the video element and the Google Maps element. The ACF integration also allows you to add repeater fields. We'll go over this in another video. You can also use ACF within your loop elements. This can be done by using a custom query where you can select an ACF relationship source as well as using ACF fields to choose how to order a loop.